It's officially spooky season in NHL 22. Yo, what's going on Leafer Nation? It's Leafer back again and welcome back to the channel. Today we have a new event that literally just dropped about 15 minutes ago. We're going to run through it and we're going to rip some big boy packs. Let's get into it. So as you can see from this banner, Halloween Rivals Master Set items available in packs and sets. We're going to run through it. So uh, let's go show you guys these cards. Uh, so let's, yeah, let's just get right into the collection. There are some very good Master Set cards and some good um, just... Uh, random cards that they threw in here as well. So looking here, we have a 91 overall Sidney Crosby. He has Gladiator. His superstar ability is back at ya, and his uh, zone ability is magnetic. 89 face offs, which is pretty good. 95 puck control, 95 passing, 98 hand eye. He's at 90 speed, 89 endurance. Uh, 91 balance and agility 90 acceleration with gladiator gives him a plus two to balance rich plus yeah plus two to wrist shot power plus three to body checking a plus three to shot block and a pretty good looking card here we got a 91 overall claude Giroux. he's got protector as a synergy uh tape to tape as a superstar ability and his own ability is 1t 94 face offs which is actually huge for mr claude Giroux. um some pretty good puck control and passing 92 speed 92 endurance if i was gonna make one of Crosby or Giroux in all honesty man it looks like I'd make Giroux one because uh, I do run uh, the synergy protector man 94 face offs is huge and he's a well-rounded card looking at the 89s now we got Erasmus Anderson he's got spark um, as his synergy he's got heat seeker as a superstar ability and his zone ability is bouncer it's a pretty decent looking card for a defenseman 89 speed 92 endurance 89 excel uh, 92 balance which is pretty good he is a little bit of a smaller build at 6-1 which isn't that small 89 passing 89 puck control it's a pretty good looking card if you're looking to upgrade your defenseman looking here we got the big man himself jesse pool his synergy is well rounded uh tape to tape is a superstar ability and his zone ability is unstoppable force this card looks absolutely unreal at 6-4 he's got 90 speed 90 excel 91 agility 91 balance um a really good looking card a really good looking shot um that's not a bad uh look in uh yes uh, jesse pull up pull yarvi get into our 87s we got quinn hughes uh booming shot as a synergy seeing eye as his superstar ability and his zone ability being spinorama this card looks absolutely unreal man 92 speed 92 excel 84 balance so he will get knocked off the puck pretty easily at 5 10 170 but it's a pretty good looking card he's got a very good looking shot again if you're looking to upgrade your d-man um it's a good shout there and then looking here uh we got claude lemieux uh well, let's get back to him as we're gonna look at kale mccarr i believe this is the last msp he's got gladiator um make it snappy as a superstar ability and his uh zone ability is in reverse now looking at this card man 92 speed 84 balance so it's, it's a similar looking card to kale mccarr to um quinn hughes um maybe a little bit less of a, a shot but pretty similar card um i don't know who i take out of the two they're, they're both good looking cards now looking here we got claude lemieux i'm not going to go through everything but we got an 87 claude lemieux we got an 86 jordan bennington we still have some more msps he's got distributor his zone or superstar ability is x-ray and his zone ability is last stand it's a pretty good looking goaltender and then we got cam talbot at the 86 here uh fly the zone uh no timer superstar ability and whirlwind is his zone ability now looking at the other cards we also have an 86 max Matthew Kachuk, we have an 85 Sammy Sallow, we got an 85 Henrik Zetterberg, uh, Aaron Ekblad has an 84, Darcy Kemper at an 84, this card actually looks unreal, uh, we got Darren McCarty at an 82, Ryan McDonough at an 82, Johnny Boychuk at an 81, I know I'm going pretty fast for these, uh, but it is what it is, Ryan Suter at an 81, Stu Grimson uh, at an 80, and George Larocque at a 80 and uh, those are all the new cards now you, you guys are obviously wondering how do you make these cards I got you guys looking at the Halloween rival sets so you can trade in 21 random players for a random player that I just showed you out of the 87s to 80s not the master set players now to make master set Crosby here you got some some options you can trade in 87 plus a bunch of 86 pluses a bunch of 85 pluses and a rivals collectible for a 91 Sydney Crosby or you can trade in uh, 31 players here, a bunch of 83 plus overalls, a couple 84 pluses, and a couple 85s, and a Halloween uh, rival collectible. Now, you can do that for all the master sets here. Obviously, depending on the rating, there's going to be more or less players that you got to trade in. 
but it is all the same here with the collectibles. So 13 and 31 for Crosby. Same with Giroux. For the lower end guys, 9. Um, so looking at Rasmus Anderson, you trade in 187 plus, a couple 86s, a couple 85s, and a rivals collectible, and you get that Rasmus Anderson. Same with Yessi Pugliarvi. Uh, and then Quinn Hughes is the same as well, I believe. Uh, same with Makar. And then you got this one here, which requires no um, Halloween collectible, but you need an 87 plus Penguins player, any Philadelphia player, and then a bunch of 87s, a bunch of 86s, and a bunch of 85s. So it's obviously cheaper to do the front end of the sets here. Um, so I, I don't hate it. It is a little bit expensive, more expensive than the last sets, which is expected. You got higher overall cards, better players. Um, if I'm going to do anyone, it's going to be uh, Claude Giroux or Jesse Pugliarvi, to be honest, man. Um, I think I can probably get it done after this pack opening, uh, but we'll see. So those are the sets. They're, they're kind of expensive to do if you're a free-to-play player. If you spend some money, you might have the cards in your collection already. Um, but yeah, that's that. Looking at the Halloween Rivals here, if you complete all these, you get a Halloween Treat Pack, which I believe is in the store, which I will show you right now. So the Halloween Treat Pack is just a 17.5k pack. But looking at, this, at these packs, we got a Haunted Starter Pack. 16 items including a power-up collectible and two guaranteed 80-plus overall players. It's an okay pack. Here you got the Halloween costume pack, 30 items, at least five initial players, and a guaranteed of 10 gold players. Here the Halloween tree pack, 25 items, at least 10 players, and a guaranteed 78 plus overall. And then you got a batch one goodie pack, which is 12 items, including a Halloween rivals player item, and five guaranteed gold players. So not too bad, not the greatest packs. I don't recommend buying them, but if you want to do it, I won't. I won't. I will stop you. Now looking at the hut challenges, you guys must be wondering how do you get these Halloween rival collectibles? Yeah, you do them by you get them by just playing uh, the challenges, which is always a lot of fun. So that's everything that's new in the new event that they just dropped. Let's open up some packs. We got our rivals packs and we got our champs packs here. So as you can see, two jumbo elite players packs, two elite packs, and one NHL players pack. So we will start with the NHL players pack. We are hoping if we can get a master set player, man, that'd be huge. Um, if we can get a bunch of 83s, a bunch of 84s, a bunch of 85s, so we can complete one of the sets, that'd be ideal too. So let's get into it. I'm excited. I've been holding on to these packs for so long. I've been so tempted to rip them. Thank God we waited. And our first card is a new item from the event. It's an 81 overall Johnny Boy Chuck. Probably won't make the team, but we pulled one of the new cards already. Uh, that was quick. We got an Andrew Manji, a Pane, Cody Glass, uh, Ryan Kessler. Come on. Ryan Nugent Hopkins, not too bad at an 82 overall. We do need 83 pluses though. Kyle Palmieri, Tyler Toffoli, Frank Vertrano, and an 81 Milan Lucic. So um, it's it's a pack, I guess. All right, onto the elite pack. 10 items with at least 580 plus overall players. We have two of these saved up. Come on, EA, bless us here. We have yet to pull a master set player item this year or like a power up icon. So let's see what we can get here. Hopefully it's good. Uh, we got a New York Islanders jersey, Capitals jersey, a bunch of jerseys. Um, can I get my players? Tristan Jari, okay. Uh, Tyler Bozak, a celebration. Rasmus Ristolainen, and a Barbashev. That was a lackluster pack. All right, we got one more of these elite packs. I thought these elite packs were better, clearly. They ain't the greatest, man. I don't know. We got a Peter Mrazek, newest Leaf, who is coming back, actually, after being injured. Uh, Robert Thomas. We have yet to pull an 83 plus, which we do need for these sets. Can we pull one? Ryan Getzlaff. Okay. Come on, man. Oliver Wallstrom. That's probably going to be it, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. That Those are horrible. All right. Now we're on to the big boy packs. Like when I say big boy, these are like big boy packs. Jumbo elite player packs. 20 items. All gold players with at least 18. Leafer 18. 80 plus players. Give me something here, yay. All right. Here we go. Come on. Bless up here. Bless up. Come on. Here we go. Dominic Kubalik. Uh, primetime JT Comper. Won't make the team, but cool looking card. Uh, we got an icon. Not, that's not a power up icon, so not ideal. Derek Brassard. Jonas Brodeen. Jumbo Joe Thornton. Uh, Elias Patterson. Those, so there's an 83 plus. That's nice. Uh, Essa Lindell. Jake DeBrusque. Joe Pavelski. Can I pull a purple, please? Tyler Bertuzzi. Tori Krug, a bunch of 82s, a bunch of 82s, but no 83s. This is unreal. Adrian Kempe, oh my, Justin Schultz, and that is it. What a lackluster pack opening it's been so far. I'm, I'm going to cry. All right, we'll hit this one with our nose here and hope that the nose pack 
brings us some luck. We need some luck here. Come on, EA. Brant Clark. All right. Interesting. Come on. Matt Zuccarello. Ain't it. Derek Broussard. Ain't it. Matias Ekholm. Ain't it. God. My God. I, I don't have pack luck this year. Not even 83 pluses here, which is like actually hurting my heart. Ryan Johansson. Beauvillier. Mackenzie Blackwood at an 83. Sure. We get another Halloween item. Ryan McDonough. Doubt he'll be used. Uh, Brandon Sod. Philip Grubauer, 83 plus. We'll take that. Oh, Nick Sealer, Duncan Keith, Travis Konechny, and Mark Giordano. Okay, uh, we have one more pack. Watch. I wanted to save my Hutch Hams collectibles, but man, I'm not happy with this pack opening. We're going to get something in this last pack, man. It's always the last pack that hits, right? Surely. Another Jumbo Elite Players pack for three Hutch Hams collectibles. Here we go. And this one's tradable. So let's see what we can get in this, man. This is a pack where we need something. Rope Hints isn't it, though. Come on, man. Sam Reinhardt. Milan Lucic. Alex Kalorn. There's got to be something, man. Jacob Truba. Oh, my goodness. Another JT Comper prime time. I'm, I'm, I'm not happy right now. Jordan Greenway. 87 Austin Matthews. That's my guy. We pull a purple. Matthews, he's got to go for at least a little something because of his x-factor card we pull a base austin matthews there's our purple that we wanted the last pack hit and it was tradable we get to trade him off we'll take an austin matthews don't mind if i do and then an 85 steven stamkos hello buddy how are you how are you back to back great pulls matthews and stamkos we will take that colton Pareko. we still got a little bit of this pack left maybe there's something else in here i doubt it but let's see that is it hey you know what man we will take an austin matthews and we will definitely take a steven stamkos welcome to the team anyways guys that's going to be it for today's video if you guys did enjoy it be sure to drop a like on it if you guys are new around here make sure to hit the subscribe button down below and let me know what you guys think of this new event is that a w or is it an l anyways guys like i said that is it for today's video thank you guys very much for watching and i'll talk to you guys later peace